Hey everybody, it's uh, well day 19. Uh, I think it's the last day of September, and uh, we uh, are crossing, finishing our route through New Mexico. Today we got to Clayton, and tomorrow we'll cross into the dreaded Oklahoma. And um, nothing exciting to talk about in today's ride. Um, at the beginning, there were some serious climbing action, some 8 to 10 percent, 13 percent, great, um, and I raced to the top, and uh, we regrouped and went on our way. Basically, it was the Austin, Jeff, Joseph trio that um, pulled across. We um, started hitting a little bit of a downward slope, so we really crushed the last several 20 miles or, or so. Anyway, blah, 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 that's just the standard stuff. I thought today I would just talk about what it's like to be biking across the country from a mental point of view. Um, as you can see, it's hard to even keep track of what day it is. Uh, fortunately, being tied back to a home and work uh, helps keep you a little bit grounded. Oh yeah, today's soccer practice for my daughter. Oh yeah, I got to get back with that client of mine right away and make sure that their needs are being met um, answer a bunch of emails etc so it still keeps you somewhat tied to the rest of the world but um, half your day is just spent pedaling and living out of a suitcase and going from one hotel to the next and one meal to the next um, I think one of the hardest things was yet uh, let's see yesterday I didn't get to put it in the blog. Had a lot of technical difficulties yesterday. Um, what I wanted to mention, though, was when I got on the bike on yesterday, um, coming out of uh, Taos, and it was the day after our rest day and all. Both mentally and physically, my body and my mind both said, "What are we doing? We're..." biking again? I thought we were done. Um, rest days can be tough because your body starts to rec go into recovery mode and uh, your mind starts going into recovery mode even though you know you're not done and um, pedaling out it was kind of a weird feeling and then it, it, I never really got in a groove yesterday. It was one of the tougher rides that, that I've done and uh, fortunately today kind of got my mojo back and felt like I was uh, pounding the pedals, did a, did a lot of the pulling today, uh, well as did Austin and, and Joseph, we really uh, make a great trio as far as taking turns at the front and uh, crushing through the wind or the, up the hills or whatever. But um, you know, it's a different lifestyle, there's no doubt about it. Uh, fortunately with technology, like I said, you can stay connected, but um, you know, uh, it's it's getting hard to keep track of what, what all is going on in the world. We joke at dinner that, you know, we're not aware of what the stock market prices are. We're not aware of, you know, the big news or, um, or what's going on with the world. Because for the most part, we uh, by the time we get in, we shower up, get our blogs done, get, get in touch with family. In my case, do some work. Um, some others actually too. Austin, uh, I know, has had several meetings on the road, things of that nature. Some have even had meetings with uh, people in different cities live and in person. So um, it doesn't leave much time for being in touch with the rest of the outside world, the other things that are going on. You have to be pretty focused on little pieces here and there. So that's kind of what it's like. It's I know it's kind of a foggy description but and it's really hard to explain without being alongside but um, we're, we're pretty close to halfway there believe it or not today was day, day 19 tomorrow will be day 20 the halfway point in days and I think somewhere in day 21 we kind of cross the miles uh, halfway point so that that'll be pretty exciting we're a little bit nervous like I said about Oklahoma because uh, it's flat if the winds blow in the wrong direction it's gonna be brutal and it's just a long, long stretch. We're going through the entire state, including the panhandle, along the top. So um, there'll be a challenge to pulling that off. 
in any case my spirits are back up knowing that uh, we had a good day today and uh, just hoping that uh, we stay healthy and strong if you have any questions or comments be sure to send them my way i'd be happy to address them have a wonderful day talk to you soon